So I think one very important part to note is how important Greek like Greek life technically is here on campus. Um, and so one thing to mention and note is that some fraternities have their frats here on campus. And I know for some people that can be really intimidating. Um, for me, it wasn't, but I've heard for some people that they don't feel really comfortable having some fraternities or um, sort of being having a place on campus. Like it's different having them off campus and being able to avoid that whenever you want. But pretty much if you can have your fraternity on campus, um, it, you know, it's just a thing that's there. And to me, it's not really a big disturbance, but for some other people that may not be the case. Um, so just be aware of that. Um, Penn is very involved in Greek life. Uh, I don't know numbers compared to other schools, but what I can say about the University of Pennsylvania's involvement in Greek life is that about 33% of students get involved in Greek life. Um, and for, in terms of people who are looking for scaling, that's about at least 3,000 out of the 9,000 plus students, undergraduate that attend here, the University of Pennsylvania. And then you also have to consider the fact that some people um, are graduate students here and may have submatriculated, so they're technically still involved with their fraternities, but we're only talking in terms of undergraduate numbers anyways. So that's just like a reference number and scale for some people who are interested in Greek life or um, just wanna know about how much Greek life is involved here at Penn. No, it is not a requirement that you join some fraternity or sorority here at the University of Pennsylvania. You can do as you want. Like most people I know said they don't plan on it or they don't really care. I mean, it's not that big a deal. Like at the end of the day, you're still you, okay? You're still gonna have the same amount of fun, okay? It's just a difference of how much money do you wanna pay every semester? Yeah, so like you're paying dues. Like, do you wanna pay dues? Do you wanna go broke? But do you wanna go broke? Okay, that's the real question. But anyways, um, yeah, so you're not really required to do Greek life, nor is it anything special. Um, that will make you less of a person or less of a student here at the University of Pennsylvania. So do what you want, just to let you all know, um, Greek life is sort of all over the place, but Penn is taking bigger steps to ensure that Greek life isn't getting out of control. So in terms of hazing, um, there was an incident earlier this year and other things like that. But you know, the University of Pennsylvania is taking steps to make sure that that doesn't continue to remain a problem.